Hello everyone, so this is a quick status update on what I've been doing. I, uh, I would like to start making more lockpicks. And uh, these are the two handles that I'm going to be uh, making, uh, mainly looking forward. Uh, these are aluminum handles. And they are in different sizes. This one here is for the slightly li larger radius Abloh locks, like the Abloh Profile. And this one here is for the slightly smaller or normal radius uh, Abloh Classic and other 6mm radius locks. They will have the coating capabilities. As you notice, this one here didn't. I um, they they will. It's uh, just that uh, I didn't put it on this particular one. And they will have uh, set screws to be holding uh, each one. Just ignore this back piece here. It's uh, merely a prototype. The back pieces will all uh, look like this. So you have two set screws. One for the uh, larger radius. And it also has a wire holder inside of there. That's uh, 1.5 millimeters. It will also have a set screw for it. And there will be a single set screw to be holding the pick tip or front tensioner, uh, whatever you decide to use. It has six increments over the course of uh, 90 degrees. That is because most detainer locks have six, uh, six gates over the course of 90 degrees. Uh, however, uh, there is a chance that you might see another part here that has um, maybe five increments over 90 degrees. There is a line here that you can use to track it with. And these heights here are in two millimeter increments so that you can sort of see what disc you're on. It has some knurling for extra grip. And to be quite honest, knurling just adds a bit of detail on it, so it looks a bit nicer. Uh, you can buy tips with these guys here. I do not have a set of tips to show you right away. Uh, however, I am thinking of doing Ablo Classic, Ablo Profile, Standard Disc Detainer, Pick, Abus Style Pick, both front, back, tension, and potentially a middle tension. Uh, so in the future, uh, you might see some uh, uh, different types of pick they, picks. They will not be able to be compatible with this, and that will be for Abloy, uh, Abloy Exec, um, uh, and the, the Protex lines. So, um, uh, but right right now, uh, I I do sell these things here. Uh, I was thinking of starting selling them for uh, about sixty dollars. You can email me right away if you want any of these. I do make them right now. But I'll be making the pick tips uh, a little bit later when I get the uh, uh, the steel and the tools uh, for making those. Uh, so uh, thanks a lot for watching and I'll see you in the next video.